Happy holidays, everybody out there on YouTube. Elric Ferris, your host here at the Tech of Tomorrow YouTube channel. Well, check it out. My iMac 27-inch i7 model only came with eight gigabytes of RAM. And so that kind of sucks for I'm trying to use Photoshop or do anything major with my computer. So my friends at Kingston, thanks David, were able to provide me with a 16 gigabyte upgrade kit. So what this video is, is this video is showing you how to install this memory into the 27 inch iMac. So check this out, it's a pretty easy procedure and I think anyone can do it. All right, so the, probably the very first thing you wanna do before doing your upgrade is set down a soft closet to not scratch your screen. Now, this is my 27 inch iMac i7 edition. What we're gonna be doing here is we're gonna be taking out the standard memory and replacing it with the 16 gigabyte kit that we got from our friends at Kingston. So what we have to do first is this plate down here, there's three screws that must be removed. We'll remove them and then we'll move on. Okay, so now you can see where the memory's at. There's gonna be two plastic tabs in here, and what you need to do is you need to pop these tabs both open first, because what these do is actually pull out the memory. So you take these and you pull those out, and those remove the memory. So you have to take out all the old memory, and we'll get past that first. As you can see, it's very easily done. Then after that, you gotta put the new memory back in. So we're gonna start from bottom to top. And this, you can see the bottom is actually the lower part of the screen. And then we're gonna follow on with that procedure going to the top. Now what you wanna make sure to do is you wanna make sure the memory makes a solid click when you install it. Like check this out right here. You can see as it pushes in, it kinda has a little click. You probably might not hear it, but that's what happens. Then you wanna take this and follow it and put the black tabs tucked back into the system just like you removed them. After that, put back on the outside little bracket and you're good to go. You should be able to start your computer up and see your new 16 gigabyte upgrade. So thanks for watching. I hope you like this vid.